Assalamu alaikum guys welcome back to civil engineers youtube channel with the new video guys today i am on construction site and i will show you in this important video four big mistakes and common mistakes in this plant beam okay so guys you should avoid these mistakes which i am telling you in this video because these are common mistakes in every construction site i can see because these are common so you should avoid this so how you can avoid so i will tell you some information related from is 456-2000 some mistakes are present in this beam okay so i will tell you from is 456-2000 so let's start guys if the video is helpful for you so don't forget to like this video and subscribe the channel with press bell icon if you are new so guys you can see in is 456-2000 we read that the bottom uh, bottom steel bars and plant beam should not be less than 12 millimeter you can see this is dia of steel bar at the bottom for plant beam okay you can see so here total numbers of steel bars used six at the bottom there are two numbers okay which dia is 10 millimeter and is 456 2000 said don't use less than 12 millimeter dia of steel bar in plant beam okay so this is 10 millimeters so this is a big mistake and common mistake so you should avoid don't use less than 12 millimeter dia of steel bar but this is just 10 millimeter let me focus this okay and also at the top they used 10 millimeter die of steel bar look at this okay so this is the first mistake now the second mistake that is for spacing for strips okay you can see is 456 2000 said that don't use uh, the lapping uh, the distance between two stirrups should not be more than you can see okay so here is about 13 inches you can see you can see this is one feet and 13 inches you can see so this is the second big mistake so this spacing is 13 inches so this is wrong okay now guys i will also show you the other mistake you can see this is the giant column and beam okay so this is column and this is beam there isn't any development length so they didn't use any development length for this so this is the third mistake you can see because this is insufficient so they should use here development length okay because development length transfer uh, are at make the bond between concrete and steel are at make bond between column and plant beam okay so this is the third mistake now you can see guys the fourth mistake let me show you also guys you can see this is this is strip dia okay this is the stirrup dia but we said the stirrup dia should not be less than from is 456 2000 the dia of the stirrup should not be less than six millimeter but this is not six millimeter okay it's less than six millimeter okay six millimeter is minimum so we should use more than six millimeter for uh, stirrup okay dia for stirrup but it is also not six millimeter but it's less than six millimeter so these are some common mistakes so you can also see uh, binding wire binding so it's wrong so this is not a good binding so guys you should avoid these mistakes which i've discussed the front of you for bottom bars dia of bottom bar should not be less than 12 millimeters okay and top bar dia should not be less than 10 millimeter okay so this is 10 millimeter it's okay but bottom bar is wrong now you can see it's spacing so it should not be less than you can see okay it's about 13 inches but it should not be more than 12 inches 12 inches become Okay guys, so this is a short video which I have discussed the front of you, how you can avoid these mistakes. So these are common and big mistakes uh, on site, so you should avoid. So thanks for watching, see you in next video. Goodbye.